This is Darshana Gauchen with your B2B Cambodia market update for July 10th, 2024. The Cambodia Securities Exchange Index was down by 3.19 points or 0.76% to 415.54. Total trade volume was slightly up to 89,190 shares changing hands at a total trade value of 429.3 million Khmer real or roughly 104,300 US dollars. On the main board, three stocks were up. Grand Twins International led the market once again with a 3.17% or 100 real rise to 3,250 real per share. Pestec Cambodia was up 0.82% or 20 real to 2,450 real per share. And Royal Group Phnom Penh SEZ was up 0.44% or 10 real to 2,280 real per share. On the downside, Cam GSM was the biggest loser of the day, down 1.63% or 40 real to 2,420 real per share. Following in second was the Phnom Penh Autonomous Port, down 1.41% or 240 real to 16,800 real per share. Other stocks down were MGQ Education, the Scenicville Autonomous Port, and the Phnom Penh Water Supply Authority. Aklata Bank remained flat. On the growth board, both companies were up. DBD Engineering was up 0.48% or 10 real to 2,090 real per share, while JS Land was up 0.28% or 10 real to 3,640 real per share. Grand Twins International took CamGSM's place today as the highest traded stock, with 40,796 shares changing hands at a value of 133.4 million real or 32,400 US dollars, equivalent to 40.7% of total trades on July 10th. Following in second was Aklata Bank, with 20,505 shares traded at a value of 154.3 million real or 37,500 US dollars, accounting for 20% of trades in the market. In other market news, the Securities and Exchange Regulator of Cambodia signed a Memorandum of Understanding with Aklata University of Business for cooperation on raising awareness and human resource development in the security sector in the Kingdom of Cambodia. The main purpose of this MOU is to raise awareness and financial literacy among students who are potential future investors or human resources for the Cambodian security sector. According to Dr. Pon Narin, Rector of Aklata University of Business, through this MOU, the university will design a training course for students aligned with the standards, laws and regulations of the SERC, also with a focus on the preparation of corporate governance policies. The Khmer real to USD strengthened slightly to 4,116 real per US dollar, while the US dollar index was up to 105.10. Oil prices dipped on Wednesday as the impact from Hurricane Barrel dissipated and inflation data highlighted stubbornly weak consumer demand in top crude importer China. Brent futures were down 58 cents or 0.69% at 84.08 US dollars a barrel after falling 1.3% in the previous session. Gold futures were up 0.5% to 2,379.4 US dollars a troy ounce as hopes grow for a US Federal Reserve interest rate cut sooner rather than later. Stock futures, meanwhile, were little changed on Wednesday afternoon after the S&P 500 notched a fresh record close. Futures connected to the Dow Jones Industrial Average dipped 9 points, or 0.02%. S&P 500 futures and Nasdaq 100 futures climbed 0.05% and 0.15%, respectively. This was Darshana Gauchen with your B2B Cambodia Market Update for July 10th.